If apples float because they are 25% air, what percentage is cyanide? Did the Supreme Court classify tomatoes as vegetables because of their toxin content? Why do almonds need to be heated before they're safe to eat? We are all aware of the dangerous surprise of mystery mushrooms. But what about potatoes? There's more to the story and we'll dive into a list of unexpected food with a toxic twist that you need to be aware of. Serving up smiles one dish at a time. Food is thy mood is now live. Hello moody foodies! Delicious and dangerous might sound like an odd pair, but believe it or not, some of the tastiest treats come with a side of risk. Let's dive into a list of foods that, while we absolutely love them, carry a bit of a risky side. Keep it light and fun, shall we? 10. Cassava or Yucca This plant may not be a staple in every American kitchen, but it's big in the Caribbean and South America. A bit of a double agent, cassava can either be your sweet best friend or a bitter foe, thanks to its cyanogenic glucosides. Fancy for super toxic. But did you know how cassava transforms into the beloved tapioca? Most folks prefer it bitter to keep the bogs at bay. But mess up its prep and you're in for a not-so-fun adventure called Konzo, leading to paralysis. Here's a kicker. Cassava is the secret behind tapioca. And those leaves, they're toxic too, unless you mash them up and sunbathe them to break down the cyanide. Plus, when properly prepared, cassava serves as a versatile base for both savory dishes and sweet desserts, highlighting its culinary adaptability. 9. Pufferfish Ah, the pufferfish, swimmingly holding the title of the second most poisonous vertebrate. Not a local delicacy, but in Korea and Japan, it's a risky treat. What makes some chefs risk their reputation in this dangerous dish? Some parts of this fish are off-limits because they're packed with a deadly toxin causing paralysis and sometimes death. Yet, it's a culinary dare that many can't resist. Fun fact, the emperor of Japan has banned eating puffer fish. Talk about royal food restrictions. Despite its dangers, chefs trained in the art of preparing puffer fish are highly respected, blending culinary skill with a dash of daring. 8. Mushrooms With about 5,000 types in the US alone and a handful being lethal, mushrooms are like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. Picking the wrong one can send you on a stomach-churning trip. Thanks to toxins like alpha and wreaking havoc on your liver. Remember, wild mushrooms are probably not your friend. And here's a mind blower. There are 38,000 mushroom kinds out there and 5% are a no-go. Enthusiasts often engage in mushroom foraging, a practice that combines the thrill of the hunt with the pleasure of cooking. 7. Cashews Surprise! Cashews aren't nuts but seeds that play hard to get by hiding in a toxic shell. Those raw cashews at the store? They've been steamed to strip away urushiol, the same irritant found in poison ivy. Handling them raw can lead to some itchy business. Did you know? In some places, the cashew fruit is the main attraction, and the seeds are just a crunchy bonus. Interestingly, the cashew apple is highly prized for its juicy sweetness in countries where it's commonly eaten, overshadowing the nut itself. Now what fiery delight comes next? Challenging even the bravest spice lovers. We'll talk about 6. Chilies Ever bite into a chili and feel the burn? Thank capsaicin, the chemical that gives chilies their kick. It's so potent, it doubles as a paint stripper and is the fiery ingredient in pepper spray. Despite the heat, chilies are vitamin C bombs, with a single green chili pod packing six times the vitamin C of an orange. Some chili aficionados participate in contests to determine who can handle the hottest peppers, testing human limits against Capsaicin's fiery challenge. 5. Potatoes The humble potato has a dark side. Its leaves, stem, and even the spot itself can harbor a toxin, especially when they start sporting a green hue. 
While munching on a green potato chip won't do much harm, indulging in green sprouts or skins could send you on a one-way trip to Nap City or worse. But hey, potatoes are space-worthy snacks. They've even orbited Earth aboard the Columbia. Innovations in agriculture are constantly being explored to reduce the levels of toxins in potatoes, making them safer and more sustainable. 4. Almonds These crunchy treats are actually seeds that need a little heat to shed their toxic cyanide attire, especially the bitter ones. They're so ancient they get shoutouts in the Old Testament. Almond cultivation has become a science of its own, with growers meticulously ensuring the safety and quality of this beloved seed. 3. Cherries Cherries are the Swiss army knife of fruits, but beware the pit. Damaging it releases hydrogen cyanide, which can lead to all sorts of unpleasantness, including a potentially permanent nap if you're not careful. Ever wonder how something so potentially dangerous can also be so beneficial for sleep? But on the bright side, cherries are packed with melatonin, making them perfect for a restful night. Cherry pits have found a second life in crafts and jewelry, where they are polished and used as beads, showcasing the fruit's beauty in a new form. 2. Apples An apple a day keeps the doctor away, unless you're chowing down on the seeds which contain a hint of cyanide. It takes a lot to cause harm, but it's best not to test the theory. Plus, apples are natural floaties thanks to being 25% air. Apple varieties are continually being developed to enhance flavor and nutritional value, ensuring there's always something new to try. But which beloved plant, often at the heart of culinary debates, carries its own set of myths and truths? So let's delve into 1. Tomato Love them or hate them, tomatoes are a kitchen staple worldwide. Just steer clear of the leaves and stem, which are laced with glycoalkaloid, a pest control favorite. And for a fun slice of trivia, the U.S. Supreme Court once had to decide whether tomatoes are fruits or vegetables. For tax purposes, they're veggies, but botanically, they're fruits. The debate over the tomato's classification has inspired culinary experiments that blur the lines between fruit and vegetable, enriching our dining experiences. And there you have it, a fascinating journey through the deliciously dangerous side of our favorite foods. Which one surprised you the most? Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to join us on more culinary adventures on our channel. A big thank you for tuning in, and remember, sometimes the best flavors come with a little bit of risk. Stay curious and keep tasting the world safely.